is about uh, automatic output management system. Uh, we are utilizing this system to reduce the manpower costs and uh, other fuel consumption. Uh, this is a basic circuit board. We have uh, two driver circuits, um, Arduino Mega and an RFID reader here. And we have a GSM board. The GSM board is used to uh, update or uh, we will inform the user about the current details of the backup. Uh, what happens is when the car arrives near the toll booth system, the RFID reader uh, will fetch the unique, uh, unique code of the RFID tag. Using the RFID unique code, we'll fetch the uh, unique bank. Uh, it's not like a bank account, it's more uh, like a wallet account. It's rechargeable. What it does is when the a tag is detected by the RFID reader, uh, the doll would automatically credit some amount of uh, money from that account. Once that process is complete, the GSM reader here will inform the user about the, uh, the updated details of the wallet account. Once the payment process is complete, uh, the doll gate will open allowing the car to pass through. Um, to create an account for the RFID unique tag, uh, we have uh, utilized uh, ThingSpeak uh, ThingSpeak. ThingSpeak helps us to create a uh, separate account for a valid tag, uh, something like that. Okay. Uh, what we do, uh, what we are doing now is when the RFID tag is sensed by the RFID reader, uh, the ESP module will access ThingSpeak software. ThingSpeak website. Uh, ThingSpeak will, will uh, show the current details of the emission rate. The ThingSpeak uh, server will will display the updated de updated account details of that particular RFID tag. Uh, this will be a, a continuous process, and you can uh, the things pick server automatically updates itself every time the car passes a toll board. This contains the automatic system. Hmm. Hmm. It generates an, uh, a key, a separate. Uh, it's more like a public or private key. Uh, that is in something like a cryptography in network security. Uh, when an ESP tries to access the ThingSpeak website, it generates an API key, like this one here. Okay. Then we have the data import or export, uh, where uh, it will show something like an Excel sheet that will display the time details or the date details when a car, uh, when the car approaches the toll gate. Okay, this is the Excel sheet that shows us. Uh, okay, this Excel sheet shows us uh, about the various detections that happen uh, in that particular time.